check, everything's check. <laughs> What's up guys, it's me Jan and today welcome back once again to my channel and to my video and today we'll be talking some different kind of topics so before we go to the main topic I'll be talking about a little bit of my phone, my college and etc etc I'll be talking some minor things before we go we jump straight to the main topic of this video so first of all which is I do have the Samsung Galaxy S8 Plus and I do really love it since it is waterproof it has 35 100 milliamp hour battery and it has a really good camera and a rear and front facing camera and of course the screen itself is really beautiful especially it's bezel-less and yeah etc etc so the first thing is that which is the waterproof itself I do really love this phone since my phone my phone <laughs> My phone tends to get oily at times because of my fingers. I don't know why. Maybe when I keep up, when I'm touching my face, I, my face is pretty much oily at times. So yeah, uh, I tend to actually hold my phone. It's, it's of course it's fingerprint magnet, and it's really hard to clean it with just cloth. So the only thing is that I just clean it with water before I just clean it with clean cloth. That's how it works. And uh, at first I was really scared because are they? Because I've seen a lot of videos like some people's phones, which is the Samsung Galaxy S8 Plus, actually gets broken because they try to test out the waterproof if it works, but some of them fail, some of them work. So I was really scared at first. So when I tested it, it was fine. I tried it in the shower. Uh, don't even, don't you even dare think about what I'm doing in the shower. I'm just watching YouTube and hearing some broad podcast. Okay. <laughs> I'm, I'm listening to podcasts or maybe now I'm hearing some music just trying to test out the waterproof of this phone I'm not doing any cheeky I'm not even watching anything don't even don't even dare think about doing thinking about me doing something nasty in my in the shower okay <laughs> okay so um, so the next one which is the battery itself um, before we start first of all I'm not pretty much a tech review guy so I'm just taking you know, my opinions about this phone since I do already have this for like a month already so I just want to say about how it feels like what is it really like to have a Samsung Galaxy S8 Plus and S8 so back to the topic which is the battery itself it's really good I do really love it 3500 milliamp hour battery and it takes with a uh, daily usage I tends me to actually get for uh, this phone stays about for two days for me since I don't really use data most of the time since I don't have anyone to chat with I don't <laughs> And I don't pretty much do anything about when I comes when I go pretty much outside because I just spend like uh, with my friends and just like having fun in reality. Just like instead of like focusing on the phone while doing hangout with my friends. So yeah, with my daily usage of this phone, it takes me out for two days before it goes to low bat and yeah. Next thing is which is the camera itself. I love the front facing camera. It is wide and it's plus it's really good and it has that really crisp quality i don't know with the other phones yet since i haven't tested them yet and also the rear facing camera is really good i love it uh, some people here in the philippines a lot of my friends keep on saying that this phone look is like pretty much a dslr since i'm you the whenever i take pictures with a uh, rear facing camera they say it looks like it's uh, captured by a dslr but it's not it's just using this phone so yeah this phone is really impressive when it comes to taking photos yeah, especially the front-facing camera is perfect for groupings and selfies addicts out there. <laughs> Compared to the iPhone, which is kind of a bit zoomed in a little bit, so it takes a little bit of like um, arm range. So when you're just like in this range, it's really wide already. So you have no problems at all when it comes to groupies or maybe selfies. So so the final thing about that is the screen itself. Look at that bezel screen. It's really beautiful. It's really beautiful, I still must say. I love it so much and the infinity display of course and the edge is not that pretty much a problem it doesn't annoy me that much since they have this like a little bit of gap so it doesn't actually affect it whenever I'm using the phone itself since I'm pretty much lowered so yeah it doesn't doesn't annoy quite annoy me that much so and of course and when I'm watching um, YouTube videos or maybe movies it's really perfect and it's really good and it's really pleasing to the eyes so the next thing which is the bad thing about this phone is the Bixby button itself. Um, I accidentally pressed Bixby a lot of times. It's 
it's really quite annoying and yeah uh, whenever I watch a YouTube video and a movies in my phone uh, I tend to watch it this way so my pinky finger is pretty much between the volume rocker and yeah between these two my pinky finger is always there so uh, at times my f uh, my pinky finger slips and actually accidentally uh, press Bixby button Bixby button what Bixby button at most of the time so it gets quite annoying and it really interrupts my mood in watching videos in YouTube and watching a movie so the next thing is that um, whenever I play music uh, sometimes I'm too lazy to use the freebie the AKG headphones that the Samsung has provided um, when I'm too lazy to actually press the button from the headphone itself I always press the volume rocker so I always use the volume rocker itself so at times I pretty much press the Bixby button so I've been wondering why the volume is not going down and it's just that I press the Bixby button without noticing it and so I have to actually take off my phone and just like uh, back and just like press the volume rocker and stuff so that's also one of the negative things that I hate from the Bixby button so yeah and that's pretty much for the Samsung Galaxy S8 phone preview of what uh, what it feels like when you have it so the next topic is that I am back in school it's been four months since the vacation yes it's a really long vacation and it's really good but back in college I am third year in college I'm supposed to be fourth year but some personal problems personal reasons have happened in the past so yeah I've been delayed for one year so yeah but it's not pretty much a problem for me since this one is not pretty much not a race you just have to like do your best and just fight it I mean it's pretty much natural when it comes to college to experience this kind of things so yeah you guys be wondering what course I have I have the course is a Bachelor of Arts of Multimedia Arts this is pretty much a new I don't know if it's new here a uh, few years already but this course is really fun and it's based on major on graphic designing itself some uses um, people major in photography since we have that class and of course videography uh, it's a pretty much a wide field a course so you can pretty much do anything you want when it comes to technology and arts you can become a graphic designer you can become a game designer game developer you can become a photographer videographer etc a lot of things that you want to do life and yeah that's pretty much for the call for the college and next one I had it before now we're actually going back to the main topic is now we're actually going to the main topic itself which is why haven't why haven't I uploaded videos in the past month I mean it's been a month already since I last uploaded my video and it's pretty much embarrassing already I have failed you guys so many times I haven't uploaded videos I keep on saying I have done like a, a ton of videos of me apologizing to you guys and just like promising you guys that I'll be making a lot of videos in the future yeah that's it that's pretty much it and I do really hate myself for that it's just that I have personal reasons why I haven't been uploading videos that much I haven't been making videos that much no school of course one thing is that um, I had to fight some depressions and sometimes I had to fight some laziness of course I had to fight laziness too as you guys have known I'm pretty much a lazy person myself <laughs> but now I have my change man I am I am determined right now I have goals to achieve I have two goals right now in when it comes to real life goals and yeah one of the goals is that I would just want to give my parents a good life and of course the other one I just want to give someone special a really good life that's that's pretty much my goals right now that's why I'm pretty much determined right now I am motivated to actually do make videos do homeworks in school which is kind of a bit new to me and it takes time to actually adjust from it since for the past few years I'm pretty much a lazy person and I do really hate that so yeah now hopefully in the future um, next week I'll be uploading another video I'll be uploading that for sure I'm pretty much gonna upload next time for sure I'm not gonna lie to you guys anymore and I'm not gonna be lazy anymore so yeah if you guys enjoyed this pretty video uh, please give it a thumbs up don't forget to comment down below what you want me to do next uh, do a challenge maybe this and anything that you want just feel free to comment down below if you guys are new to my channel please don't forget to subscribe uh, and to all my old subscribers please don't forget to click that notifications button which is, has 
a bell design if you guys want to be updated with my videos if I uploaded something new soon and yeah that's pretty much it and hopefully guys see you guys in the next video soon and bye